couldn't do it. Corey, stop it. <laughs> If you missed our last video, we explored a hidden gem near Washington, D.C., Jones Point Park. We walked underneath the towering Woodrow Wilson Memorial Bridge and perused one of the last River Eye lighthouses left in America. In this video, we visit another hidden gem, the view of D.C. This free observation deck is located in Arlington, Virginia, and offers panoramic views of not only Arlington itself, but of Washington, D.C. as well. To enter the building, you need to show a valid government ID and then go through security. How is it possible that we have this whole place to ourselves? There are handy signs that point out notable landmarks you can see from this observation deck. The biggest views are from the east, where you can see places such as the National Mall, the Kennedy Center, Watergate, and the Jefferson Memorial. This is a little sketch. Mm hmm. Makes you think. It does make you think. You afraid of heights or something? A little bit. <laughs> I'm not here. Well, I can point things out for you if you need me to. Well, I can see the Washington Monument. That's the Lincoln Center. Oh, Lincoln Center? What's it called? The Kennedy Lincoln. Center. Oh, <laughs> I thought you said the Lincoln Memorial is a no, Lincoln no. Center. I would never do that. Stop. <laughs> If you pay me, couldn't do it. Corey, stop it. <laughs> it's enough fun for one day. Solid as a rock. From the terrace, you can see some Arlington landmarks like the Iwo Jima Memorial, Arlington National Cemetery, and Reagan National Airport. Just making sure it's good. There's Solid. Four, four panes of glass, but nope. this situation, I don't feel as confident around. What you doing there? Testing the limits of my fear. Okay. Maybe we don't test the limits of our fear. I have no fear. <laughs> One cool thing we learned from the interactive signs was that Reagan National Airport was built mainly because President Franklin D. Roosevelt was tired of waiting for Congress to select a site for the new airport. President Roosevelt laid the cornerstone of the terminal building at the dedication ceremony in 1940. The airport's original name was Washington National Airport, but Congress changed the name to honor President Ronald Reagan in 1998. <music> they mean when people say you could hear a pin drop because it is so quiet here. The view of DC isn't always as quiet since they do host weddings and events here. There are usually more interactive installations as well, but they have been scaled back due to COVID. Don't let some of the structural quirks sway you, as this is a great way to see some of the nation's most iconic landmarks in one place. 
Next time, we'll be visiting some of the unique shops in the historic district of Ellicott City, Maryland. See you then!